Um, some people said, aren't you a bit late? Um, well, actually, no, we're not actually a bit late. So it's, uh, oh, the first chapter of Christmas is over now. Uh, I bet you've all taken your decorations down, haven't you? Uh, some people take them down on Boxing Day, and they don't even leave the, leave the 12 nights. We, we, we've started packing away the first chapter because our Christmas tree is gone. We've still got our Advent wreath because the candles are going to stay there for 40 days until candle mass. That's another story. And oh, oh we've still got our Christmas crib. Um, well, it's complete. Do you know, for a couple of weeks, there are a few people missing, and they only arrived last week. Who, who, who arrived on the crib in the last couple of days? Well, last Sunday. Yeah. Yeah, go. Who, who came on? Pardon? Who, who, who came on candles? Who came on candles? Oh, this. And the, and the wise men? Yeah, the wise men, of course, because they're, they're really the second chapter of this story uh, because they... Don't arrive till it says in the Bible they arrive some time later, uh, a, a time we now call Epiphany. That's all right. <laughs> Can't get the staff. Um, we're, 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 we're packing away at church now. I've got a few things here that uh, I, I, I thought we'd uh, we'd better put away for another year. Uh, I reckon that can fit you. <laughs> Will that fit you? Yes, just about. <laughs> and we've got another one. Now, would you like to be a wise woman? Come on, be a wise woman. Because in, in these days, in these days, we have to, oops, we have equal options. Right, wise women and men, come out here, please. Come on, you kings, let's have you out here. Because you're the experts, because you came at the time we now call it Epiphany, so you can tell us all. Um, what did the wise men bring with them when they came to visit the baby Jesus? Presents. They brought presents, they did, they brought presents. And where did they come from? Where did the wise men travel from? Now, I don't mean Portsmouth. Or, did they come from lands a far way off? Did they? Yeah. Where did they come from? Lands far away. You're right! Lands are far away off. Yes, you did. Um, you can go sit down. Yeah, down. Because the important message of those wise men that came from far off was that this baby Jesus, this wonderful present of Jesus, was not just for the people in the country where he was born, but for people all over the world. The gift that Jesus was bringing of love and peace and kindness, these wise men came to tell us it's for everyone, everywhere, all over the world. So I think we should remind ourselves of the wise men and sing a little bit of that famous song, We Three Kings. Three kings of Orient are bearing gifts. We travel so far, field and fountain, moor and mountain, following on the star, oh star of wonder, star of light, star with royal beauty. But westward leading, still proceeding, guide us to thy perfect light. Glorious now, behold him arise, King and God and sacrifice. early days they they ran little children's homes where boys and girls who weren't lucky enough to have nice families at home could go and live in a happy environment with grown-ups to look after them just like mum and dad would have done 
And they ran nurseries and day centres to support children who were in great need and their families. Over the years, things have changed. Today, we've got social services and children's departments and all sorts of things. And the need for adopting and children's homes is, is gone a bit. But there's still a lot of work that the Children's Society can do today. Not so much with babies and little children, but with teenagers. Now, we all know the problems that teenagers today have in their lives. Looking for donations because the work the children's society do that is so important with young people today actually costs money and later on there'll be an opportunity when you come to collect your Chris Single to, to put a donation in the plate here if you would like to scattered about there are um, envelopes as well that you will have seen it, if you'd like to take one away especially if you're a taxpayer and want to fill in that bit which makes it 25 percent more by gift aid to do that and pop it back to church in the next week or two we'll add it to the collection but why there's an orange in as well because that love of god that he showed us through jesus extended to jesus giving his life for everybody so we've got the red ribbon we've got the orange and uh, but not least of course we have Our candle. And each Christingle has a candle, and later on this, morning, this afternoon we're going to light the candles. And uh, what do the candles remind us of? Oh, what a minute. The light of the world. The light of the world. And who's the light of the world? God. Very good. Would you like to come and light our big candle? Come on. Would you like to come and give out some Chris Singles? <laughs> she doesn't listen. Anya 
Corinthians Sapphire are coming to read for us. You came as a baby, Lord, as a little helpless child. That frankincense, but I think it might smell different. There's, there's more in that one than there is in that one. <laughs> so we've got frankincense, gold, and mare. Anybody got any idea what those gifts are? Who might have brought those gifts? Yeah. This again. Let's try this in this box here. I'm not sure. Is the coin. And give them some light in what might be a time of darkness otherwise. So with that in mind... Let's pray, and let me offer you God's blessing for this time of Epiphany. Heavenly Father, thank the song together. And we can't celebrate Chris Stingle without singing Shine, Jesus Shine. Oh, but before we do, and Harold, Howard, and thank you, Howard, for playing for us today. It's just lovely to have a proper organist. Um, <laughs> um, we all know Shine, Jesus Shine. Uh, can we have the first verse up, please, Elizabeth? Um, and you will know... That is it's traditional. When we get to the last line of each verse, it goes, shine on me, shine on me. But after, actually, after each shine on me, we go. <laughs> so let's have a practice. Shine on me. No, that's not good enough. Shine on me. Okay, Howard, we're ready now, thank you. of your love is shining in the midst of the darkness shining Jesus light of the world shine upon set us free by the truth you know shine on me shine on me shine Jesus shine fill this land with the Father's glory Bless Spirit place, set our hearts on fire. Flow, river, flow, flood the nations with grace and mercy. Send forth your word, Lord, and let there be love. As we live, sell your soul. and mercy, send forth your word, Lord, and let there be love. And finally, as they say, do have a safe journey home, happy epiphany. Uh, we've got quite a number of Christians left. We're going to put them on the